Facebook, YouTube, what is up guys? Today is February the 8th. We're on our first job of, and only job of the day. Uh, we have a screen and recoat we're gonna be doing um, to some engineered floors. I went out this morning for one of my repeat clients who have been using us over the years for carpet cleaning. Um, they also booked uh, our next slot for the 21st uh, for a screen and recoat. And then I had another screen and recoat wax removal that I did an estimate for last week come in for the 22nd. Uh, so today is February the 8th. We're out here in the Cummings, Georgia area on this nice beautiful day and i'll show you guys what we're going to be doing um, this is a client that found me i think they found me on facebook i came out here gave them an estimate to uh get the floors back looking good and the floors are not really that bad but like i said they want to uh, do a maintenance they said these scratches were created yesterday when they did the uh furniture moving um so show you guys um what we're going to be doing here this is 1,164 square feet of screen and recoding at a dollar and 50 cents a square foot. So you can see here, guys, we got some areas where the floors have took a beating, uh, not some of the wood veneer off right here. So we want to correct that. Um, also right here, going to fill this area in. Uh, so like I said, the floors are not bad. But again, they have dogs, they have kids, and they just want to keep the floors maintained so they don't get worse. And that's the benefit of screening and recoding is to keep the floors maintained so it doesn't get worse. Over here, got an area where it's starting to, the veneer is starting to wear off. So uh, this is what we're doing, guys. So you can see the client got all the furniture moved out the way. So we got this area right here, the dining room right here. Then we got this foyer, which we're going to start back out. Then we got this area, whole area right here. Uh, this small bathroom, this area right here. And then we're going to go around. There's Mr. Scobie. Hey. And around here, the, the island, and work ourselves out. So we're going to go ahead and start screening these floors down, guys. Get them uh, clean, tacked, and recoated. Come back and show you some results. Stay tuned. All right, guys, we are done with the screening. We are done with the clean and tacking, post vacuuming, and also color correction. If you guys remember all those areas that was missing color, we blended that back in. I actually showed my client those scratches over there. We was able to take care of those scratches. You can't even see them anymore. Also over here, this board right here was able to make that look a lot better. So she's very happy with what she's seen so far. So now what we're gonna do, guys, now, is get ready to roll the uh, first coat of poly. I also called my next two estimates, let them know we're running behind. Um, <clears throat> so we're about to get ready to roll the first coat of poly 
Also, a lot of areas over here were missing color, came out really well with the color correction, and also a few areas right here. All right, guys, we're going to get started to put this first coat of poly down. Stay tuned. All right, guys, look at the floors putting their first coat down. Now, this is a satin finish, so it's not going to have that wet gloss look when it dries, but man, these floors are gonna look amazing. Uh, we did tint the poly, add some more vibrant color to the floor. Um, one of our um, customers love when we tint the poly. Uh, it always looks dark when, we're, when we pour it out, so just show you right, look right there. See how it's really dark, but as you see when Scoby rolls it and smooths it out, it's not as dark, but it does help add that more uh, uh, color um, shade to the floor. Look at that, guys. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. Yeah, more richer look. So it's just a technique that we use, um, again, just to make the floors look a whole lot better um, as we're putting the poly. And we usually just do it in the first coat. And then the second coat is a clear coat. All right, guys, stay tuned. All right, guys. How does the floors look? It looks good. Yeah, it looks good. I'm excited to see the finished finish. Yes, ma'am. So we're going to go ahead and get that. We just uh, prepped our second coat. So uh, we're going to let that rest for about five minutes and get that put down. But man, these floors look so much better. And you see why all those, that, that, that cut those colors, uh, you can't even tell anymore. Yeah, it's fabulous. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> All right, guys. So, so I just. Um, your partner said that you'd start upstairs and, and we're going to come this Right way. back down. Yes, ma'am. So I'm going to make sure that my kids, we're going to stay outside. We're going to stay on that back patio. Okay. And then when you're done, we can come around and I can get your payment and everything. Yes, ma'am. And everything will be all locked up. And we'll get out of here and you'll get out of here. All righty. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, Facebook, YouTube, we just got back from lunch. We also just went and did another estimate that went really well. Um, just a lot of great things are going on, guys. Um, had a company reach out to us that found us on YouTube that was very impressed with our videos. Oh, they look so much better. Um, you can't even tell anymore. I uh, was impressed with our videos, and they want to do an interview with us and also premiere our videos on their YouTube channel with over 10 million subscribers. So, guys, again, just everything is just doing good. We had a few estimates come in while we were going from here. Um, we also had about four or five new clients uh, today that have booked estimates to get their hardwood floors done. And um, this is the, the results. So again, this client with, with a set and finish. And what we're gonna do now is get ready to prep to put the second coat down, and that will do it. Well guys, we thank you again. Courtney Scobie, Truman Services. See you in the next one.